An umpire is a cross between a bullfrog and a goat. He has a mouth that's flannel lined and brass tubes in his throat. He needs a cool and level head that isn't hard to hit. So when the fans speed up his frame, they'll have a nice place to sit. The only job that's worse is driver on a hearse. How'd you like to be an umpire? Work like his is merely play. He don't even have to ask for all the things that come his way. When the crowd yells, knock his block off. So Kim Good says every fan. Then who wants to be an umpire? The brick bats whiz when he gets his. For the umpire is a most unhappy man. How'd you like to be a camel? He don't ever mind the heat. He has seven lovely stomachs. They're all full of things to eat. But he travels without drinking. Seven days to say the least. So who wants to be a camel without a drink? Well, I don't think, for the camel is a most unhappy beast. Napoleon and Washington were generals of old. Their lightest word moved regiments and armies, we are told. Where'er they led, men followed them, but only came for hire. Just think of all that gratis come to follow the bold umpire. He leads them with such vim, because they're chasing him. How you like to be an umpire? Work like his is merely play. He don't even have to ask for all the things that come his way. When the crowd yells, knock his block off. So him good, says every fan. Then who wants to be an umpire? The brick bats whiz when he gets his. For the umpire is a most unhappy man. How'd you like to be a mermaid? Live below the glassy sea. Why, if you could swim like she can, what a cinch this life would be. But suppose she took a streetcar. Suppose the cable broke in two. Then Who'd want to be a mermaid? Gee, what a shock. She couldn't walk. Wonder what the dickens would a mermaid do?